Is it recording? Yeah. Hello and welcome to another one of our product um, review videos. Um, this is for the Romex pull-up chin-up bar. It also does other things as well. We're not, we're not going to go too mad with this. We're just going to show you basically the fundamentals about it. And if you're thinking about buying it, um, does it work basically? That's really the crucial thing. So there's a couple of things to this. You have the, each side ex um, moves in and out. And the way you control that is you move this. It's got rubber grips here. It's got these locking things here that should fit into these. Yeah. And it's got one each side. And they, they come back onto this one. And they literally go like that. And you can adjust them via thumb screws. Um, so the way you loosen it, you need to, obviously you've got only to find a decent door frame on the inside. The way you loosen it is you'd literally just turn it anti-clockwise. Towards the floor, basically. Towards the floor, yeah, so that way. And as you can see, that's loose, and that's the bar. So it's really easy to fit. And you can turn these independently of each other to start with, just to uh, get it to fit. Get the width of the door. Yeah, right just there. so you don't have to do it too much. So what we want to do is get them in there. It doesn't mark or anything. It's got nice blue pads. Get them in there like that, and then I'm turning clockwise now. Towards the ceiling. So I'm literally going, and you can see it pressing against the door frame. I'm going to go as hard as I can and then lock them off and then these bits here moving towards these grooves and what these things do here is it stops these things from turning that would loosen it so they're locked and there's one each side and that's it really and that's and I can yank that it has a little bit of play in it because that's just with the joints but it doesn't move so it's got quite a bit of those grippy handles on oh yeah it's got these nice nice handles uh, pull up, bars, chin up it's, yeah, chrome. Solid, it's, um, it's about 40 quid, um, but you can put it anywhere in the house. You Have can you thought about the brackets there as yeah. well, because it's obviously wider, so it puts all the stress on There's the actually frame. a mechanism inside here according yeah. to it, so we'll take that off for a minute and have a closer look at that. So we do anti-clockwise to take it off. It's, very, it's quite heavy duty, nice construction. These are the rubber pads. The grips. It doesn't mark the door. Well, it leaves a little. It leaves a little bit of a res that. residue, but that's just because it's tight on there. But it's not marking it. But it? really, if you're looking at getting fit and stuff, I don't think. It's, and you could probably just wipe that if you're that yeah. bothered. I don't think you're really that bothered. So this is the Romex panel, Romex pull-up bar, and um, if you're thinking about buying one, it does. Uh, it does definitely do what it says on the tin. It goes against the door frame and um, stays there. I mean, the marks on the door frame is nothing more than some brush strokes. Yeah, you know. don't worry about that. And that's tight as anything, that. It's easy to put up, easy to take down, and obviously storage is, if storage is a premium. Solid. Yeah. Good bit of kit. So that's, that's, our, good... that's our sort of mini review on it. Yeah. But it's just showing you, like, will it, will it pull off? So how much, no, was that? how much did it cost that? About forty pounds. But wasn't it reduced? It was reduced, yeah. So I'd say if you want to do a bit of exercise around your house, then it's not a bad product to have. Purely on the basis that I would say I'm a little bit older, is ease of putting up, ease of taking down, and ease of storage. So you've got basically like an exercise piece of exercise equipment here that you can take up and down really yeah. easily. And in all honesty. Put in your suitcase. And um, when you've finished with it, you just have to loosen it off a bit, put it away, and then you don't have to wind it all the way out. You just, next time you put it up and just tighten it up a little bit and then cap them up, just tighten these up and then it's it's ready to go again. That's a good idea. Right, thanks for watching. Yeah, Hope and um, if you like the video, do us a favour, subscribe, help us along a bit. Thank you.